I'm reminded of the pool of Bethesda, right? And at this place, there was a lot of people that was blind, paralyzed, and crippled. But at a certain time of the year, an angel would go down and stir the pool. And whoever gets in first would be healed or whatever it is they was going through. So Jesus approaches this man. And this man didn't even recognize he was talking to Jesus. He didn't even recognize that he was looking at his miracle face to face. Don't mess around and miss your manifestation and your miracle because you cannot discern the moment. There are divine times and appointments that God has for you to walk in. So Jesus asked the man, do you want to be made well? I believe a lot of times God wants to know how bad do you want to break through that you are asking me for because some people don't want deliverance they just want attention so the man says i have no man to take me to the pool to get healed see some of you you depend way too much on people and god's finna shift that perspective and that faith in you to let you know that your blessing is not gonna come by people but by my power but i will use people but i'm the source of it and the man says other people will get in before me and get healed okay and some of you feel like just like that everybody around you is getting blessed except for you and, and, and god is saying right now and you in this season where you don't have to go chase after the blessing but the blessing is coming to you so can you imagine the level of competition can you imagine everybody else trying to run to the pool god says what i'm about to do in your life is not gonna come by way of competition but it's gonna come by way of covenant because you're in covenant with me and i'm doing what i have promised you and jesus told the man to rise take up your bed and walk and he was made whole but the man had to do what jesus said your miracle is in your movement walk by faith and trust god to walk into your now season